A couple of special guests at a recent Warriors playoff game caught our attention. They spent years in prison for crimes they did not commit. Nightbeat's Kristen Ayers caught up with one of them tonight, found out his new play is helping a newly released man from Santa Clara County. Rick Walker sits on a stoop on a sunny day in East Palo Alto. It's been almost 16 years since he walked out of a Santa Clara County courthouse, a free man, and he still remembers every sight and sound. When I opened that door, I heard birds for the first time in a long time. I smelt a different air for the first time. Nothing recy recycled air. I felt um, my feet on ground that was, you know, something other than asphalt and concrete. Rick spent 12 years behind bars for a crime he didn't commit. He was convicted of stabbing and suffocating his ex-girlfriend and sentenced to 26 years to life. They made a choice that they were going to prosecute me, right? Even though they couldn't place me at the crime, they had no physical evidence that linked me to the crime. He served 12 years of that sentence before an attorney who was a family friend took the case up as a passion project and uncovered new evidence. These days, Rick is working to help other innocent people. He's on the board of the Northern California Innocence Project and is treasurer of the organization on his T-shirt, Exonerated Nation. Toothbrushes. The care package is for a man named Lionel Rubalcava, released from prison this week after being wrongfully convicted of attempted murder. What's really emotional for me right now is, is, is the deal with Lionel, right? Because he's going actually through the same county, the same thing, the same, you know, kind of um, adventure that I went through. Rick says his life has settled down now. When he's not advocating for the innocent, he lives peacefully, building houses and fixing cars at his home in Lake County. He says he knows why he is here now. And because of what happened to me, I learned what my purpose in life was. Assure and make sure that what happened to me, the way it happened to me, doesn't happen to another person. Kristen Ayers on the Night Beat.